Hello, today I am going to introduce my brother Kushal. Hello. He came from Hyderabad to Bangalore so that he can spend more time with me. He stayed for one week. Uh, today we are going to tell the weekend activities we have done. So, my brother is going to start. On Saturday, we went to Garuda Mall and went for Jet Simulator. Also, we went to Vishweshwaraya Museum because we loved science. And while we went there, we got so inspired that we bought a rocket model of GSLV. After we bought it home, I built it. So this is how it looks totally. And I've also read a book called Kubandi by Arundhati Venkatesh. Also today, I have done a drawing. Now, my brother will continue. And I have also done an activity of connecting a thousand dots together. This has formed into a beautiful city. I have also read a book called Ikigai. So, this book contains about Japanese lifestyle and their culture. For example, they have told us about mindfulness. In mindfulness, you can improve it by meditating and keeping yourself tension free. Get rid of all of your tensions and live a healthier life. Then, about yoga. Yoga might seem like just stretching your body to you. But it also helps you in, a, in many ways. It makes your body flexible, fit and also helps in breathing. And meditate every day with an empty, empty stomach so that you can live a healthier life. And they have also uh, mentioned about goal setting. When you are focused on your goal, uh, goals, you live an, a happier life because you are focused and you want to accomplish it. And this book has also, men, uh, also mentioned about the food intake because it is one of the most important thing in our life. They have asked us to take light food and only eat when you are hungry. And do not uh, make your uh, stomach a junkyard. Uh, the types of food you should be eating are something very light. Take less of uh, rice and take more of the curry because it has more of nutrients. They also ask us to drink lemon tea because it's a lot uh, lighter and healthier. This book has also mentioned about the food intake. Japanese take very less food and only eat when they are hungry. We should never stress our stomach and make it into a junkyard. They eat seafood because it is very light and contains many nutrients. However, Indians also have this culture but we see very less people following it. However, this book has also inspired me a lot in living a healthier and better lifestyle. One of the points I got really inspired about was the mindfulness. About taking uh, 15 minutes or doing 15 minutes of meditation to cool down my body and not stressing too much on uh, stressing my brain too much and living a happier life. Thank you. Last but not least, this book was written by Kira Miki. Thank you. And my book review on Kubandi will be in the next video. Thank you.